You know, something I wasn't really sure about was would people actually want to watch this game again since I just played it like a few years ago. Like, I'm not even sure if my voice sounds much different from then to now. The quality of the videos look better now, hopefully. But uh, anyways, all likes, everything mean a lot to me. The fact that you're even kind of like waiting video to video for this one as well means the world to me. So, all right. Love you all. Let's go ahead and get this. Right. If I follow Route 5, that should take me to the hospital. Follow Route 5. Track down Nora. Get her to tell me where Abby is. Easy. This is that chapter called the Seraphites. I think I remember this one a little bit. That UPS truck every time. <laughs> it's called something else in this game, obviously. Alright, so where are we going? By the way, I changed one of the accessibility options because... Having to, like, manually pick up ammo during a fight, I would sometimes forget. So I just turned it on to be, like, an automatic thing, though. Anything in here? Hold on, what's the, uh, we got the ladder over there. I guess we have to go this way first, maybe? Hold on, let's see. By the way, thanks for all supporting these longer videos. I wasn't planning on doing it this way, but I don't know. This game has been out for, you know, a couple years, and I just felt like playing it a second time. That's clearly something I need right there. <laughs> How do I get there, though? All right, we're not going that way. Um, look around. And we just hop over this way. So how do we... Hold on. How do I get back over there, then? Whatever. We should be fine. Let's kind of test this out. Oh, I guess I turned it off. Never mind. I was going to try it, but it is what it is. I'll actually show you what I was talking about really quick. This won't take long. So get down here. Accessibility alternate controls. Where it says automatic pickup. Right here. Turn it on. Good to go. We'll give it a shot. It doesn't, it doesn't like change too much other than just having like manually press triangle so many times, you know? That type of stuff you still have to pick up. Is there anything else in here besides just like the bare necessities? <laughs> we got a bottle. Nice. I don't see anything else. We should be fine. Oh, that's so much better. My goodness, it makes the game, like, a little easier to navigate, I feel like. Wait, was that everything? Pretty generous area so far. We haven't really seen anything yet, though. That last section with the hill crest and all that, man, my goodness. That was so many enemies. I remember when I was, like, editing it, I was like, man, that was a long section of just, like, non-stop, you know? I'm assuming... Oh, we went through there. We just go out the window, don't we? This will be one of those games where even if I start other stuff while I'm playing it, I will be finishing it. It's just a matter of time. Kind of like my casual... Uh-oh. I thought I was about to fight somebody. Let me go ahead and reload really quick. Pretty much low on everything I have. Oh my goodness. We should probably not go that way. But I bet you there's something good in there. Hmm. I 
I think my favorite weapon right now is the bow. <laughs> I'm just terrible with it. I just like that you can pretty much save ammo by having it. Yeah, that accessibility option is insanely useful. I kind of want to check out that other place really quick. Because I feel like this is the correct path to go, and I don't want to get too far into where I can't go back. Uh, okay. For love. The fuck? I actually saw a lot of the people comparing, like, the PS4 version that was upgraded to 60 frames and this one. And I can kind of see where it's almost identical in a way, but... How did I miss that? That's weird. It's almost identical, but there are, like, texture pop-ins that aren't as extreme on this version of it, so... I think I have to go to the window here. Will this even kill? I'm gonna just, like, stay here for a minute. Because these enemies are terrifying. Well, that ain't good. Uh-oh. Melee combat is always better, I feel like, than all the other ones. If you have a chance to use it, just go ahead and do that. Damn it. I'm like, it's like the bare necessities of just like not having enough. I feel like every encounter I've had so far, I've had like just, just enough to get it done. Never anything like left over. Let me actually craft. I don't have any med kits, so or health kits in this game is what they call it. And as far as this goes, we got 74. Let's see. Craft melee upgrades. Let's go with this one. The clarity will be a little bit better. Man, this is extremely useful. The only bad thing is, I don't quite know what I'm picking up half the time. <laughs> Just wanted to try this out. Maybe I don't have it on the entire game, but we'll see. Like, I'm more surprised that I have ammo just now, because I didn't even see what I picked up. You know, there's a lot of games that I've kind of covered over the years, and it's like, I'll remember pieces of them here and there. But it's crazy that, like, games from my childhood, like Metal Gear Solid, Resident Evil 2, you know, the original ones, I remember all those, like... All right. You know, that Dawn of the Dead quote. <laughs> the 2004 one where he's like, why did they come to the mall? He goes, I don't know, maybe memory? That's kind of what I feel like with those games. This is kind of like, maybe after this playthrough I'll kind of remember more, but... Okay, I think we're going through here, and then we can go up that way, but let's try this out first. I just feel like we're going to get stuck down here after have to fight a bunch of stuff. Oh, so we're going up. Never mind. The one part of this game I remember more than any of it is the ending. <laughs> I can't really... I don't want to talk about it because it's like we're getting there, you know? I was so passionate about it. I remember I'd make like that review video and all that. Hold on. I don't see any glowing. And the distance should be better now. Oh, this thing says carry. If I break this window, am I about to get ambushed? Hold on. Let's look around first. Make sure we're clear. We can't go through there. Never mind. There's some good stuff in there. There is some good stuff. Okay. Blocked by that. We climbed up. Came over here. Wait, is there anything in here? I see a bottle. Huh. 
We're supposed to take this, I'm assuming, and... Maybe throw out the window or something? I'm really not sure. I'm gonna break a window really quick. Imagine if that actually broke it. I don't really feel like this is what you're supposed to do, though. No, it's gotta go... Wait a minute. Oh, I think we go through... Do we go through the door? No, I don't think you can do that. Well, I guess the good news is I can actually hop back up if I do it that way. We're trying to get to the other room right there. Let me look around and see. I can break those windows. Yeah, I think maybe... Hold on, does this go... I want to see if I can actually make it through the door with this. Because if I can, that would be insane. No, imagine. <laughs> that'd be that'd be clean if you could do that. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. Is this actually gonna break though? I don't know if that's gonna work, but Yeah, because we have to be able to get over there. That might not work. Hold on, let's see. Maybe it will. Gradual. <laughs> Gradual. That's pretty cool. Oh my goodness. Another trading card. Nice. Hold on, hold on. Shift. Let me go ahead and craft more of these. I'm torn, Dwight. You know what? The Molotovs have been so useful. Let's also craft one of these as well. I wouldn't light it just yet. Hold on. Man, there's a lot of ammo in here. My goodness. I don't want to have this on right now. Let me go ahead and just remove this, because... I'm kind of worried if I accidentally have it on when I don't actually need it. I'll be in, like, a panic state and won't really know to, like, take it off. Alright, looks like we're good. That's all it was. There we go. I feel like these types of moments are what kind of make the game really good. You know, like not a, uh, no story, no anything, just you kind of like exploring, figuring things out, the puzzle system here and there, kind of reflecting on everything that's happened up to this point, you know? Where's that cat going? Do not block 24 hour access, okay? I doubt this is unlocked. Yeah, I'll be shocked. Oh, shit. Need to get in there. Can we move this? No, I imagine. <laughs> if it was blue, I bet we could. Hold on. We can go up here though. Anybody in there? All right, let's see what it says. Darling, I've packed everything. Let's see. Overabundance of caution, but Fedras have been confiscating things due to quarantine. Okay. I feel like every TV and, like, TV stand in this game looks identical. <laughs> that control C, control V, am I right? Hey, let's go. Three-fourths. Oh, it's, okay. Hold on. I did look and see what I did last time. I think this is like a date type thing, isn't it? Wait, pen? 
Wait, is pan really the same button as my flashlight? Let me just do this. Okay, hold on. Let me just take a picture, try all three of these. I looked at, like, what I did before. Because I had to, like, start a brand new chapter for this one, obviously. Every time I record, I start from the beginning of whatever chapter it was. Unless I'm, like, in the middle of one. But I usually try to finish it out if I can. That, that day, if, at least, you know. Um, but I had almost everything in this section. I had, there's, like, two safes in here, I think. Alright, let's try... Alright, so it says go back 30 years from their actual, like, wedding date, which was actually on, uh, October 8th. And if it was 2013, that would be 83. So let's go 83. Hopefully that works. I mean, that has to be right, right? There we go. There. Well, I'd say if that was not it, would have had some problems. Alright. Got everything else. Looks like we're out of here. <laughs> Wait, what's through here first? This entire section just feels like a restock area. Nothing crazy yet. Yeah, this this accessibility thing is made. Running around a room and collecting stuff so much easier. Still gotta like open up drawers and stuff. Okay, hold on. Let's see. If that's that one, let's go ahead and trap mine. I feel like trap mine's the way to go. Stun bombs are nice, but they don't really do anything. I feel like they don't do any damage. It seems. Whereas that definitely will. This city's still filled with supplies. Wait, wait. Another bottle. Workbench. We haven't really done anything here yet. For, I think since we got the bow at least. This has range finder. Draw speed and stability. Oh, what in the world? We're not going back, understand? What in the world is this? No way. What? I was trying to just charge her. Yo, I just want to rush in and... My goodness. I don't remember that at all. Is there just one left? I was trying to conserve bullets and stuff, but I was like... Okay, I think we're okay now. That actually surprised me a lot. I don't Jesus. know if I had that instance last time. What the fuck, people? Already used up another med kit. Or health kit, whatever. Um. There we go. I'm hoping we don't get a jump again. That was highly unexpected. Now, if that happened to me last time I played it, I don't remember at all. Where to get capacity for that? Damage for this. We could get the scope, which actually be nice. Uh, range finder for that one. Capacity damage. Most of the stuff I'd really want to have seems like I've already upgraded it. I kind of want to get the scope on this. Like, I'm kind of leaning that direction, but I also don't know if I really need it right now. Plus three? Let me go ahead and do that. I guess a six total. Okay. That'll make, like, boss fight. Well, not really boss fights, but, like, major infected enemies... If the shotgun's out, the bow's not going to get it done. Okay, fire rate, stability. I feel like stability is kind of useless on the shotgun. Fire rate, so I can run out of bullets I don't even have. I think I'm good on everything else. Alright. Well, that was unexpected. 
Like, literally. Ooh. It's gold, I think, so... Training manual! Be useful. What is this thing gonna be? Oh, explosives, okay. Oh yeah, explosive arrows! Improved, okay. Might as well do that, we have like, maxed out those. <laughs> Kinda works out great. It's like the game heard me talking like I didn't have any revolver ammo. And they just decided to just give me some. What was that? It's like the game like flashed or something. It was kind of strange. All right, hey Melissa. Let's see. Ugh. I thought I was a wolf. Gotta be more careful. Can we go upstairs? Downstairs? No, we can't go upstairs. Okay. Let's try downstairs, maybe? Hey, let's go. You know what game this kind of reminds me of sometimes? Is that... There was two of them. When they first came out, I remember playing them a lot. It was like State of Decay, I think it was. Why is this even here? It's like trying to prevent you from going down here or something. Oh no. What is lurking down here? Survives with that movie Barbarian. If you've never seen it, see got in here. it's a little rough. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I love the beginning of it, the middle, the ending is a little iffy, but the premise is insane. Staying in like an Airbnb and there's a dungeon under you or something crazy. So this calls tape, really? I guess it makes sense, kinda. I didn't see anything else down here. Alright. Exploration has been... pretty good so far in this video. Other than getting jumped at the, uh... workbench. <laughs> that was unexpected for sure. So we came up here, we went in there, came out the front door, looted everything, I believe. We have to be able to get through here. Either we jump on something or... My initial thought was push something, but I don't see anything to push. Wait a minute. This feels familiar. So much for following the street. I feel like you could climb this just by going over here, which is probably exactly what you got to do. Want to make sure I have anything else first. All right. Because there's no going back. Yeah. I don't see anything else set uh, here. Can I move anything? There's got to be something in here that we open, like, the garage area and then push something out. Has to be. I'm worried about getting jumped again. Let me look around in here, because... <laughs> there's got to be something I can also collect. You know, I'm surprised I never had DLC for this game. I'm sure it sold well. And the first game had, like, the Left Behind DLC, which I thought was a nice add-on, but was it necessary? The game was also brand new. Oh, okay. Damn it. I don't think... Hold on. Can I... Oh, I, I remember this now. Get a running start with it, kinda. 
rolling down, take your time, and then run up, pull the chain, and it shoots through that. So. Yeah, for some odd reason, that all just kind of came back to me just now. It's kind of crazy. It's 2024, and I'm starting the year off by playing Last of Us Part 2, you know? Did not think I was actually going to be doing that. I thought maybe I'd play for a video and stop, but... I mean, the first video did really well. Like, as I'm recording this, it's got like over 30,000 likes, ton of views. Um, and it's still, like, doing better since... I mean, it's technically the same thing I've already played once. It's not like when I played Last of Us Part 1. The three different times I played it, there was, like, something very different about it, you know? There's the hospital. <sighs> Fuck. I thought I'd be closer. It's so quiet. It's actually creepy. <laughs> Let's cause some destruction, shall we? Hold on. You can hop up here for no reason. What was this? I'm assuming we just hop down, but I'm kind of scared to. Is this open? No. All right, so it's kind of a dead end in a way. Uh. Yeah, let's climb down through that. That's why you come up here, got you. I would imagine to get across, I could also do the other thing. Hold on, let's see. Yeah, you can't hop straight down right here, which is kind of odd. I thought I'm going to take a lot of damage if I hop down. Here we go. Oh, man. I was right, too. I'm actually kind of glad it killed me and didn't, like... Okay, we're right back where we were. <laughs> I'm glad it killed me and didn't, like, make me take a ton of damage where I had to, like, pop an actual health kit. Just gotta find a way down. I swear, if I get jumped right when I land, I'm gonna be so upset. In fact, there's, like, tall grass right here that you can go prone in. Makes me think we're about to. Because we got Fedra boxes everywhere, or crates. It's like you can break this one. It kind of has that look, doesn't it? The Nomad, okay. Okay, the fact that she just drew out the arrow, I'm assuming... Stinks in here. We're definitely not alone. We got bugs, leather couches. I saw something that said what did bed bugs do before beds were invented. <laughs> Makes you wonder, I guess. We're supposed to go back the other way. I'm almost certain. I was just checking these other rooms really quick. Yeah, I'm 100% sure we're going here. But before we do that...
Oh. Just kind of collecting. Don't mind me. Serves you right. I feel like we got a lot of oh, ammo right now. Shit. Wait. Fuck me. Why'd you say that? Really? Oh, man. Are we missing something? Because I felt like she reacted, pulled out the arrow, and I didn't see anything. Alright, so I went to the bathroom area. I didn't see anything there. Not good. Maybe we go this way instead. Looks like you can move this. No, you can't. Oh, climb it up. Here we go. That is not good. Stalkers. Those are the ones that are all skittish and sneak up on you. Need to find a way out of here. I hate those things. I forgot the best way to take care of them last time. That's scissors, Brad. Come on. I can't even use anything. Amazing. Uh, make one of these. Still can't pick up the scissors, but it's all good. It's definitely been one of those games I'm happy I'm replaying now because... You know, I, I watched the show after the first season. I was like, what happened in the second game again? <laughs> I can't even remember. I was like, I don't know what happens with like Abby and everything, but the other characters, not so much. I just heard one up next to me somewhere. Yeah, there's one over there. I can't remember what the thing was. Can they... I can't remember if they're like, if you're looking at them, they don't move or what. Let me put this attachment on really quick. There we go. Have to do it, sorry. Another one. Ooh. Get off me! They just run away. Hoping they come out this way. The fact that I can retrieve the arrows. Now, the first one actually broke. <laughs> no, wait. Trying to avoid all this, but whatever. Fuck the arrow, if you don't get a headshot... Oh my god. Was that a different one, or was that the same one? Oh, 
She hasn't said anything yet, so I'm not sure if I'm actually safe or not. The fact that there was like three in that little like... Oh, there was actually more than three in the original spot. They just all scattered so quickly I couldn't really see. <laughs> I love how they just kind of peek around the corner like, You over there? What's good? That ain't good. Supposed to go through here, but... <laughs> Another one's coming. Get ready. So two body shots does it. Another one's rolling up. I can't tell what they're doing. It's like they're stuck right there. That was three more, so hopefully we're okay for a little bit. I don't know. Double check. Yeah, it's like I remember this section a little bit. But not to a point where I remember the exit. I'm assuming we just go out that way, but let me look around first. I'm not sure if I got them all. I'm sure I get jump scared here in a minute. I used a lot more ammo than I wanted to, though. Make some of these. I could go back for the other scissors, but it won't even matter at this point. You know, it's kind of surprising that this game, after all the games that have been out the last, like, couple years since this one, this one still holds pretty strong, I feel like. Like, gameplay-wise, it feels better than some of the actual PS5 games. Granted, you know, you kind of have to take that with a grain of salt because... When a game is made for, like... Whenever I see a game made for, like, six different systems. PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series S and X, Nintendo Switch, PC. You know, I'm like, okay, there's no way you can optimize all of those. But you see, like, one game, like, an exclusive... Those usually feel like they're better performing. So, but then again, that's also not true. <laughs> not always. I feel like we're okay. Let's just head out of here. I was going to be quiet, but... I feel like they're going to sneak up no matter what I do. Wait, wait. Nothing there, okay. I'm gonna break this and run. Get ready. Alright, it's right up there. I'm supposed to go through this building. Here we go. <laughs> My daughter just recently started to like this, like, uh, it's 
like a two times a week class for like three hours where she goes and just like learns and plays with other kids and stuff like that. And okay. head down to the street. I picked her up today for the first time because she just started and it was just such a cool like she was showing me her cubby and stuff. I was like, man, you're going up a little too fast. Let me wait to hill up. Hold on. I feel like what I want to do is use these stun bombs and run up start meleeing or... Oh, shotgun. I forgot all about that. Like I forgot I even had it. That's why I didn't want to heal up. I had a feeling. Okay, the fact that we're maxed on this ammo is insane. Next time I go to like an actual workbench, I am increasing the actual reserves if you can. I thought it was just the ammo capacity, which I couldn't change much there anyways. Oh, this is... Wait, is it a combination of the other ones and... Come on. I better not get killed here. Yep, time to go. That almost killed me. I thought it was far enough away, but... I was not. Whew, okay. Let's go ahead and craft another one of these. Go ahead and use it again. Actually, I'm going to wait. I bet I find like a vending machine or something here. That auto-aim was crazy. You know the craziest thing about this section? Is I, I remember like the actual enemies, but not the encounter. That's the only thing. I did increase the damage, so that's actually very nice that... I think it's one and done. Oh, wait. Get off me! Let's get this ammo really quick. There we go, nice. I don't know if her saying that meant no more enemies, or is that because she healed up? What an excellent game. I really like it. Okay, so that's the door we're going out of for sure. Let me look around first to make sure we didn't miss too much. Like that, the healing. I think we're okay. <laughs> I'm really not sure. There we go. All right, I'm assuming we just get out of here. Here we go. Oh. Shit. Ooh. That ain't good. What? I had no time to react there. That's insane. Okay. So happy it actually... 
once it pops open, you gotta start spamming square, which is what I was doing. You have just enough time to get that. Get off me! I don't know why I did not remember the uh, water part right there. I remembered it in Tomb Raider. <laughs> and I think it was the first game when Joel, like, put his back when they're about to hit that giant rock. He kind of, like, sacrificed himself for a second to, like, take some damage. This is not, like, one of those puzzle areas, I think. Oh, let's go over here first to see things kind of flickering. Let's collect what we can. <gasps> is this where we have to, like, use something to actually get up? I think it is. Okay. So we gotta, like, go somewhere, get, like, a pallet or something. exactly what it is we do here my initial thinking is we got to go underwater to get through one of these let's look around that actually might be what we got to do let me go back up plenish then go back under look around you can't see anything down here my goodness that's a dead end let me check over here really quick. Where we came in at. That's locked. No shiv or anything we can use. What about down here? Like, I have brightness up higher than normal. Oh, you go through here. Here we go. And I still could barely see. Please don't be anybody back here. Nice. Not sure what to actually craft more of. This does an insane amount of damage. But the problem is you kind of have to set the trap up. This is more of like a, I guess, get away quickly type maneuver. Um, I'll do this one, I guess. I did increase the blast radius, so it didn't really help when I took that damage earlier. <laughs> But, should be good. You know, I got stuck on this and it didn't dawn on me to just go across the pipe up there, but the game will give you hints if you get lost for too long, apparently. I didn't realize that. I was struggling. I don't know why I just had an idea of like, okay, in all the Uncharted games and all the Last of Us stuff I've seen, it's like, that's usually like the case is find a pallet, like the first game, and use that, but... Like, oh, I just, like, completely ignored that balance portion. <laughs> it just kind of just started walking fast. Uh, all right. Let's take the ladder, because I don't want to take excessive damage. <clears throat> Never mind. We're going to do that anyways. You know what I thought about trying if I couldn't find a pallet or anything? I thought, like, shooting this explosive barrel or whatever would, like, send some shrapnel. That's how much I don't remember. That's crazy. 
Okay. Let's not we're getting out of here. Uh, get me the hell out of here. Why is it every time I say something, she like repeats it, or something close to it? Some snacks. Very nice. <laughs> this game has been such a cool re-experience type game. Wasn't sure if I'd have enjoyed it the second time. Just because of the story, you know, I remember a lot of stuff that happened towards the end of the game more than anything else. But I also didn't know how, like, everybody else would enjoy it, you know? Seems like everybody likes the first game better than the second one. This is the Seraphites thing, isn't it? I already see the the area we're going through. Get the bow ready. Hold on. These are the ones that whistle, I believe, like over and over. Yep, here we go. Got a few ways I can actually play this. I can just go for quick takedowns, try to be stealthy, wait it out pretty much, or I can just. Forgot that even happened. I know I'm here now. Well, this isn't good. I will play corners all day if I have to. The blast radius was so crazy. I didn't know if it was going to get all three or if they all hopped on together. It might have, but... Man, they are all over the place. Okay. Can I just, like, guess? I was waiting for it. I've been saving Jeez. those. These must be the scars. Doesn't matter. Hospital. You better not have strung Nora up. I don't know if we're in the clear or not. I really could not tell you. <laughs> like, this is just like one of those types of moments where... Okay. Here's the road to the hospital. If the enemies are gone, I feel like she puts the weapon away at least. Sometimes she'll have dialogue, but... 
I'm assuming we're okay. I doubt there's any loot here. Hold on. Oh, we got some there. How convenient. Let's go. Let's get it. All right, let's put this in the journal. I actually will take a look at the journal. I haven't done that in a while. All right, let's go ahead and check out the entry. Scars, stay focused. I'm kind of doing this so you can actually pause it and everything. I think I missed a few pages back and back. Yeah, I think we've seen this page. Yep. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, as far as I know, we just go through those doors, but anything else open? Locked, nothing there. What about this side? Of course. Alright, Garden Suites, here we go. This is gonna be bad, I feel like. That's so loud. It is kind of a cool experience. One thing I wish that didn't get cancelled was the multiplayer. I think Destiny 2 had something to do with that as well. Where it's like they didn't want to commit time and resources through Sony to that. There's a safe behind us, but let me see if there's like a... Note. Oh no, it's not a safe. Never mind. But I remember playing, I think it was Uncharted 4 had like a multiplayer. And I actually used to play it a lot with some friends, like on PS4 I think it was. And... I just remember those types of games having great multiplayer. And I think Last of Us did have it, but not Last of Us Part 2. I could be wrong though, don't hold me to that. I'm not sure, I just I don't remember the uh, multiplayer stuff too much. I just remember swinging like on the ropes and stuff, going across platforms to each other was really cool. I feel like I've spent most of the entire series up at this point crouched. We're hopping out here obviously, but before we do that, reload and get some other stuff first. Hey, let's get it. A little proc noise whenever you can craft something is actually kind of nice. Every time I hear it, I'm like, oh, what can I craft? I feel like these are like my saving grace right now. Almost every enemy is like sneaking around on us. All right, I think we're good. I don't know if we hop down and go that way, or we... Can we go up top any? Oh, wait. Oh. There's got to be stuff back here. There has to be. Nope. There's got to be a way to access that on the other side, though. It says locked. We can just break the window, can't we? Hey, let's get it. Man, that's a lot of stuff. Let's go. The pills are good. Alright, if anyone finds this, my wife Paige is waiting for me back in the old conference center at Pike Man, and Convention. That sucks. Please take this medicine. She could die without it.
I'm scared to open this door. There's got to be a reason it can unlock from the other side, too. No? Okay. I think we're good. Now we can hop down. Not from this height, though. <laughs> That'd be rough. I think... Hold on. You can't go any further... Let's just hop down this way. 